about 12 hours after the suspected rapist escaped from police custody. The State Commissioner of Police, Zaki Ahmed, confirmed the incident while speaking with journalists at the command headquarters in Port Harcourt. Ahmed said the police officer responsible for escape of DK has been arrested for negligence. The police commissioner heard members of the public to assist the command with useful information that will lead to rearrest of the suspect. However, the escape didn't go down well with some activists in the state. Personally, I'm in shock to hear that a high-profile criminal like that who has even confessed to the crime before the police was allowed and let off the hook for whatever reasons. In fact, I'm even surprised that the Commissioner of Police in River State is yet to tender his resignation. This, this doesn't portend anything good you know, uh, for the fight against crime and criminality. Because there was no jailbreak, so to speak. So it's how, how could he have escaped? We are talking of uh, the state CID, the uh, building, where you have lots of hordes of security men, policemen. Uh, I, I just can't comprehend it. I just can't fathom it. I was a little bit uh, staggered by the information this, when I heard it this morning. So uh, if the commissioner of police is unable to, within uh, 24 hours, rearrest that suspect, then he should also be placed on suspension so that it will serve as a deterrent to uh, security personnel. Father of the rape victim, Meshuba, also urged the police to ensure that the suspected ritualist and undergraduate of University of Port Harcourt does not escape justice. From Port Harcourt, Lukman Yusuf, Liberty News.